Hello everyone, my name is Ronald Marlaruya, and in this video, I'm going to be reviewing the independent film Metro Manila. For this video, I will in fact note some of my favorite scenes in this movie and some of the things that I found found that is a little lackluster but also still significant and very powerful messages about the truth and the harsh reality of Melentro Manila. So our story begins by telling us a little tale of a person that we haven't yet met but that, that the narrator is actually our main protagonist. The film then begins by showing us the, the life estate of our protagonist's family and of how um, broke they are in this in this scenario and they decided to move and to at least at least they hope to get a better job in Metro Manila little did they know they'll in fact be greeted with some and actually realistically harsh realities and very very tragic bad choices that they'll be making along the way As the story progresses, more and more characters begin to pop up, and some characters are actually just side characters, but for some reason, in fact, had a huge impact to our family. As we were, as we were watching them, making bad decisions, horrible scenarios that we are being put on, and how desperate they are for money. Things that are actually does happening in the real world here in Metro Manila. Metro Manila really reflects that one of the biggest and most falsely messages that Philippines have been putting up to many many people throughout the years that is that if you go to the Metro Manila they will offer you a job well there is truth in that however the truth is that it's even more harder for there are people who will do anything just to get a job and for desperation for money not all jobs, in fact, are in fact good for good things, and not all jobs are really are respectable, and some are even twisted to doing good and to doing bad. To avoid spoilers, I really wanted to tell you guys how unbelievably predictable some of the plot twist is, but let's just say before. When I first watched this film and before I decided to rewatch this film, I had to appreciate the fact that it was in fact cleverly hidden, but also cleverly pointed out. By what I mean of this is that when, by when I first saw this film, I actually predicted one of the twists that I believe that will happen and eventually did. But when I actually review it for the second time, I actually get to see how they actually put that twist on and what did I miss before I even watched it. It was a clever way of saying to the audience of how, um, that's the word I'm looking for, unique their story can be and how tragic it is actually, uh, it, uh, it is actually is and how sad reality can get for our protagonist and for his newly accommodated friend. The movie plays a powerful message to many people. Sadly though, in sadly though, when it actually was in fact um competed against in Britain's uh film festival, it wasn't even nominated. But yet again, this film has a powerful message to my to many Filipinos out there. And to also give us a very memorable movie that actually tackles very harsh realities that many people need to see of how dark and how messed up society is in the city of Metro Manila. And what is the and what have the characters have done just to just to get through the harsh reality and to get through their financial needs.
And so with that, I rate this film 7 out of 10 for its convoluted plot, its predictable plot twist, and also the way how characters really make dumb decisions. Especially not the no actually not even a normal person not that is not that smart or not that dumb would do in real life. The characters are pretty much somewhat unlikable for their personality and the plot can actually be a little confusing sometimes. For instance, one one thing lead to another that actually didn't it needs to matter and sometimes the perspective the perspective of which character is supposed to be the one we're supposed to be following gets confusing for it shows the fam shows the family sometimes by doing doing camera jumps of whichever character's perspective are we seeing now but i do rate it a good point for its cinematography cleverness of like showing the harsh reality of real life here in metro manila and also giving the well-known issue that giving the false hope of many many Filipinos who live in provincial areas to the to the country of the Philippines of telling them the harsh reality that there that sometimes the hope that they wanted to happen can turn into somewhat of a despair and that's all for now thank you for watching this review smash like if enjoyed this video and subscribe to this channel and else and that's all for now thank you for watching